Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. This is Mito D Green here with a continuation of last week's uh, 90s flip heads. These are the flip heads for the second season of Mighty Morphin Power Rangers when they had new zords and new costumes and new actors. So without further ado, let's start from left to right with the White Ranger. Just bear with me here. So here is Tommy. This is again Tommy as the White Ranger. Tommy is now the White Ranger and now he's the leader of the Power Rangers. I don't see how I always envisioned the Red Ranger being the leader, but that's 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 just my opinion. So let's go. Here he is, White Ranger. I have to put the shield on also, just to complete the look. And here he is. And not to forget that he also comes with his sword, Saba. One Ranger. So Tommy changes colors from green to white and three of the original actors left the show. So they had to replace those three with three new actors. So here is Adam. That is a very, very good head sculpt. Push this button here. And Adam is the new Black Ranger. I've already done the articulations for these figures in the last video, so I'm probably going to bypass them this time around. Here we have Aisha, the new Yellow Ranger. Some yellow in the back of her hair. It's very good. It really looks like Karen Ashley. Push this button. And here is the new Yellow Ranger. And lastly, here is Rocky. Once again, another really good head sculpt. Push this button here. And Rocky becomes the new Red Ranger. So this was bittersweet, as I mentioned before. Uh, the three original Power Rangers who portrayed the characters of Trainee Zack and Jason uh, were forced to leave the show. You know, they tried to give us the perception that they left, but they were actually forced to leave the show due to uh, pay discrepancies. So now we have these new actors who were really good. I really liked Adam. I really liked Aisha. I really liked w w Rocky. I really liked what all of them brought to the actual show. You know, redoing all these characters and coming up with these new storylines. It was actually pretty good to watch and kids still tuned into it, even though the three, their favorite three actors were not on the show anymore. 